هالقوارب بتدور الناس بترحل بتسور في بحري في بحري ايدي حامل مكتوب عسى يقرب القلوب في بحري Okay, so welcome back to the channel guys. I hope you're all doing well and today is going to be the usual day in the life But today is one of those days where I basically have pretty much no lectures and I've got no actual Like lessons or practicals anything to actually go over So today I'm going to be focusing on two main things and that is one of my essays Which is basically about vitamin D and this essay I'm pretty much done with it I just need to like do some edits and stuff like that and then submit it and the second thing I need to do lots of Neurophysiology revision and I've got four weeks worth of content on neurophysiology and I need to go over all of that stuff, consolidate it and also take you through the day with me. Okay so this is my essay and it's about vitamin D and obviously you can see the introduction, the main body and obviously the conclusion with the Harvard referencing style which I used. So my essay is still not finished, I'm going to be spending the next half an hour to 45 minutes adjusting it, reviewing it and then submitting it and checking the plagiarism score. Okay, so this is the plagiarism check and it says 6% which is completely fine and in case you're wondering it's 1370 words essay and yeah I'm finally done just gonna go and submit it this was my first ever actual university essay please guys let me know in the comment section below if you can relate to the satisfaction that you get once you're actually finished an essay and you submit it let me know in the comment section below and now that I've finished with my essay writing, all I've got to do is basically do two hours of neurophysiology revision this very morning, take a break in between, and right now I'm just going to go in narrate mode while I'm revising and I'm going to teach you and just show you some of the stuff that I'm learning currently in my neurophysiology course. Neurophysiology is the branch of physiology dealing with the functions of the nervous system. For example, the study of the functional properties of the neurons, glial cells and networks. Some of the key principles in neurophysiology is to understand the function of ion channels, neuromuscular junctions, nerve conduction, neurotransmitters and the pathways they take. So just to give you a quick overview, this is basically what I've been doing. So I'm going to be showing you here week 3, 4, 5 and 6. The last few weeks basically has been neurophysiology. So opening up week three you can see that we've basically done like a recap of a-level stuff so action potential synapses obviously we learn more about the anatomy of the brain the spinal cord and all of that stuff obviously we got our normal lessons which is like two hours and then we got videos asynchronous material to watch and then we've got this quiz to do and then week four we've done the cns right here which is basically the central nervous system and then if you go down we've learned about the pns going a little bit way more in depth actually so it's not like a level stuff we're actually starting to building up from our pre-existing knowledge and then that is the pns the peripheral nervous system and going down you can see the last week we've basically been going over the sensory system. So basically learning more about the motor neurons, the you know sensory neurons, all of that stuff and how they actually play a role when it comes to neurophysiology. Endorphins are neurotransmitters which are basically brain chemicals. There are at least 20 types of endorphins in humans and they can be found in the pituitary gland which is basically the master gland. Secretion of endorphins leads to decreased feelings of pain feelings of euphoria, enhancement of the immune system and is thought to play a variety of other functions in the human body. Okay, so I'm actually not bothered anymore. I'm finished with what I need to do. And yeah, it was good enough, alhamdulillah. But uh, right now I need to go and get myself a beard trim because I'm looking mega, mega scruffy. My hair's getting longer as well, but obviously lockdown. So I mean, I'm probably going to have to cut at home or something like that. But I'm going to go get myself a beard trim, uh, have a shower, relax for some time, eat lunch definitely and then head out and I just want to change the scenery a little bit, I don't want to stay at home and do an entire vlog again so I'm just going to go on campus because campus is open and we can basically go in, get some revision done, get some clips done and that's about it, it's just going to be me by myself, I'm not, I don't think I'm going to be with anyone on campus, I'm probably not going to meet anyone on campus anyway because everyone's got their own lectures and their own stuff so everyone's going to be busy so just by myself, go to the campus and get some work done. Okay, so change of plans. Basically, I forgot that the masjids were basically opening today and I literally forgot that. So I'm going to go head to the masjid, pray, and then do all of my stuff, go back home and then back to the campus, inshallah. 
إن في خلق السماوات والأرض واختلاف الليل والنهار لآيات لأولي الألباب الذين يذكرون الله قياما وقعودا وعلى جنوبهم ويتفكرون في خلق السماوات والأرض ربنا ما خلقت هذا باطلا سبحانك سبحانك فقنا عذاب النار غريب في الحياة وفي الممات ومجهول الهوية والصفات كذا كانت حياتي دون معنى أفسرها ككل الكائنات Okay, so I'm currently on campus right now. I'm actually going to go meet up with a couple of people on campus, so that should be a little bit fun at least, because the entire lockdown I've just been at home every single day. Today, now that campus is open, I might as well come in, get some work done as well. I'm going to try to get some revision done, but probably won't be the most effective revision that I'm going to do is just not going to be as efficient because I'm going to be taking breaks in between but the main point is just get some content for you guys some b words relax for some time I walked for some time as well before coming here you know lose some calories and everything I've been stuck at home every single day so get some work done I've got some administrative work to do as well so I've got some emails and some submission stuff to do and once I'm done with that head back home and then I got my tutoring session to do before ending the day. In this session I go over my biochemistry module where we have a look at proteins. Now proteins are made of amino acids and after formation proteins exist only for a fixed period of time before they're degraded and recycled by our body. Some of the major types of proteins in our body include enzymes which play an important role during the breakdown of molecules, structural proteins which provide strength to our cells, tissues and organs, signaling proteins that allow cells to communicate with each other through the use of signals, defensive proteins that help us to fight off the infection, and hormones which are basically proteins that help in metabolic activities. So basically what I'm doing right now is setting up all of the tables this way, put the chairs around there, get a nice thumbnail, but don't worry, after that we're basically going to put everything back to its original place and I'm already sweating by doing that. Okay, so time to put all of this back again. Alright, got myself changed quickly, everything back to normal. You can see the sweat droplets there and I'm gonna go find another place. Hopefully, if I can get another thumbnail then that should be good enough. Okay, so I've got absolutely no clue where I'm going. I'm just walking around and Pretty much just exploring this place because my card allows me to access it and I think these are the labs or something I'm not even sure so I'm just gonna go on my way all right so basically what happened is I was going there to take a thumbnail and just do some revision but the place that I went to like the second floor the third floor apparently we as students were not meant to have access on it but for some reason my card allowed me to go in so that's why I basically went in and I had to be escorted out because I did I kind of got lost and I didn't know how to come out of the building so they escorted me out and here I'm basically in uh, this park after taking my daily jogging to make sure my health is up to date, I head back home and tutor one of my GCC students in chemistry and physics for a few hours. Also, if you want me to tutor you for A-level biology or chemistry or GCC sciences or any other subject, then feel free to leave a message. I currently tutor a large amount of students weekly and I also provide them with my own personalized notes, but spaces are limited so not everyone might get a chance to be tutored. So again, if you want to get tutored, then make sure you send me a message on my social media or on my email okay so that's the tutoring bit finished and it's currently 
time for me to go sleep but before I go sleep I'm gonna have my little bit of milk here I'm currently watching some anime as well but I need to go and edit this video up finish off right now and then put it on my laptop and then do the editing and all of that just put them up so that I can basically come in tomorrow morning and start off with the edit nice and clean anyway I hope you guys enjoyed the video as always make sure you like comment subscribe let me know what you thought about it in the comment section below and also follow my socials links will be down there in the description below and again if you need me for tutoring or any other services just drop down a message on my email or on my Instagram or whatever yeah on my social media anyway as always, I hope you guys enjoyed the video or at least you guys benefited from the video. So I'll see you in my next video. Take care and assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu.